Cat in the Hat, the live action movie. Whose idea was this? And what, what was it, directed by Mike Myers? He stars in it. I know he's the cat. Is yeah. he? Yeah, he's the cat, dude. Oh, God. Yeah, let me... I should have looked this up right before we started. Okay, that kind of explains it, why it looks so fucking disturbing. Yeah, the cat looks disturbing because it's Matt Myers. I don't like it. It's Mike Myers. It's Michael it's... Myers. Hey, at least it's better than the actual Cats movie. Oh, no, so it was directed by Fair Bo enough. Welch. He directed The Color Purple and Ghostbusters it... 2. Did he? And Batman Returns. Like the first Ghostbusters? The second one. No. Oh. Bo Little Welch? Princess, Men in Black. Yeah, Bo Welch. Men in Black 2. The first four, Men in Black Three. Men in Black also, Two. Also, we can good. make some good movies. And this yeah. series of unfortunate events on Netflix. One. I haven't watched it. I heard it was okay though. Yeah, I mean, he directed the Color Purple. Like right there, you oh, know, well, he could direct the movie. No, he was the co- he was the project he was a production designer. He didn't direct it. Oh. He direct he he was credited as a director for Secret Agent Man, The Tick. Series of unfortunate events. So two of those never heard of. One of those is a monstrosity of nature, and the fourth one uh, I heard is a decent show. Yeah, I heard it's decent, but everything else. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he does. He's he's not a he's not a well known director for a good reason. Yeah. And tell him what the movie's about. Uh, Cat in the Hat. The cat in the hat. It's all right. Let me. All right. Let me explain. It. You know how we can do I curse? Reviews? Just the cat. Can in I hat. curse, Eli? <laughs> sure. All right. So the cat in the hat is about a bunch of little pricks, <laughs> terrible people. That's what it's about. Terrible people doing terrible things to each other, and some weird Mike Myers-looking monstrosity comes in, fucking causes mayhem. And they have to fix it at the end. That's it. The whole movie's <laughs> a fucking fever dream. It is. <laughs> and the whole, like, most of the comedy, except for, like, a couple jokes. One joke I really like. Um, but a, mo- that was, like, the only time I actually laughed at it. Most of the other jokes were just slapstick. And they were just kind of out of place, I guess. And I had, like, in uh, Cat in the Hat, you kind of think of, like, children's comedy not oh someone gets fucking hit in the balls with a baseball bat yeah like it has a bunch of like adult humor but it just doesn't really land yeah it's like they tried to appeal to both audiences but it just poorly came out as a mess like i heard enjoyable yeah i remember like enjoying this movie a lot when i was young like a kid yeah and it's it's like most things, I guess, other than Disney, where you go back to it and it's like, uh, I like this. <laughs> yeah, as like, a kid, I loved it, but as an adult, it's just, what am I watching? I had and a pause. Like, I don't want my kid watching this movie because it's like, it's not for my, adults and it doesn't seem like it's for kids either. It's like, why my parents let me watch this movie? You're like, the end of windows in this movie are crazy. Yeah, See, it, like where he takes the the picture of the picture of their mother out of the fucking <laughs> uh, the picture frame and opens it up like it's of like one of those porn mags. He's like, oh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take this for later," <laughs> and just walks away with it. He's like, "I don't understand what this movie's for." Hey, Eli, like, are uh, you identity crisis? Eli, is there like a thumping going on in your house? Oh, sorry. Oh. What were you doing? Nothing. Continue. <laughs> oh, I know what he was doing. <laughs> All right. So, like, I, like this movie, it, it was pretty terrible. It only made me chuckle once after I even forgot the joke it was. I kind of felt bad that I even laughed at the movie. Like, it was, like, I couldn't watch it, like, just the full way through. I had to pause it for a little bit and walk away. Same. And then come back. <laughs> Like, I didn't have anything to do. I just was like, you know, I'm bored. I'll come back in a minute. It, it's just not that good of a movie. It's no, one of those movies they, you remember when you was little. You're like, oh, it's probably, I remember this being good. Then you rewatch it. You're like, whoa. 
I think it's happening the, a lot, to be honest. Yeah, I think one of the only reasons I like enjoyed it was because it was quirky when I was a kid. <laughs> yeah, it had unique humor that I thought was funny because you know you weren't allowed, I wasn't allowed to make that kind of humor when I was a kid. Yeah, so like I had to be prim and proper. Oh, you dirty hoe! Oh, you son oh, of a oh. bitch! <laughs> That's what's crazy when he did that. He said like almost the whole word before they cut it. I'm like, whoa. I know. I was, I was like, expecting uh, to cut out right before the B word. Yeah, they a went. Bitch, but it was they, like. They would put the B I in there. I was like, whoa. I heard the T at the end. Yeah, I was like, okay, word. y'all need a chill. And like how they, like how we tried to cover in their ears, but they only covered like one of their ears for both of the kids. So it was like they still hear it. But you don't they recommend. They still. He- you don't recommend no, people recommend. that have seen this movie, uh, that haven't seen this movie, to see this movie? I don't recommend if people. You've never seen it once. Do not watch the movie unless you want to experience it, experience what it's like to be on LSD. It's not even a. It's not even so bad. It's a good movie. It's just a bad movie. A lot of the, yeah, a lot of the humor is bad. It's, some of it's just cringy. It was still cringy. It's a disrespect to Doctor Seuss. Like it was a disrespect. Like I felt bad for Alec Baldwin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually actors, to be honest. I don't know what they was trying to aim for for this movie because a Dr. Seuss stuff is for kids and like what they was doing, it seemed like they were trying to make a kids movie for adults, which didn't go well. Yeah, it's just yeah, can the hat's not a, a, a like an intellectual property that's used for like adult humor. I think it's always been written for like kids entertainment. You always find the can of hat books or Dr. Seuss books in like area reading areas meant for kids or children's yeah. bookstores or whatever you never find that kind of stuff aimed at adults it's or unless it's some sort of spin off that's kind of or just a rip off of dr seuss's cat in the hat or whatever you know True. It, it's never actually in itself used for adult humor except for maybe like a couple jokes want to know a fun fact what <laughs> After this movie, Dr. Seuss' widow uh, banned any city from ever making a live-action Dr. Seuss movie. That's why they haven't been done after that. <laughs> she should have done it before the movie came out. Yeah, she did, did it before the movie came out. They was going to make a sequel, and she stopped it right oh, before God. When they announced God. it. Oh, God. Thank she had, you. She stopped Gee. it right when they announced it. She was like, no. Thank you, Mrs. Seuss. Like, I don't know if you're alive or not, but thank you very much. <laughs> you saved us. Yeah, she's you a liar. Are a hero. You know, uh, uh, after she dies, then they'll be able to take the property. But till she's oh, I see. Ugh. Let's hope she lives a really long life. I hope they put her in the. I, mean, I hope they turn her into an AI. <laughs> I hope they put her into a robot. So close so your thoughts about die. the movies, guys. Don't the watch nostalgia it. Nostalgia was a lie. <laughs> don't get. <laughs> don't get yeah. Welch any money. <laughs> Please don't. This monstrosity. If you want to watch something, go any of his things. Go watch series of unfortunate events. Yeah, like because this movie was unfortunate right. events. Yeah, this, this movie was unfortunate. Yeah, unfortunately alive. Unfortunately, so you don't got nothing good to say. I will say the. Uh, I like the suit. Some of the that was creepy. The no, suit the, the suit was the creepiest part. You no, know, I'm talking about like comparing it to the movie Cats that just came out. I prefer oh, those, look, honestly. Yeah. Like, Mike Myers as the cat was kind of uh, off-putting. But yeah, that, Tim Allen was supposed to play the cat. He actually uh, wrote a script, but then they rewrote it after he couldn't uh, do it because he had to do Santa Claus 2. So he cut out Scott for me. And they rewrote he, he it. Has... Yeah, he, after that, he's probably like, "Oh, thank the Lord!" I didn't yeah, he that. probably was. I yeah, would. Santa Claus Two is probably better. Definitely, yeah, definitely yeah. way better. The Santa Claus movie next week? <laughs> no, <laughs> Santa Claus Two. <laughs> I'm not in the mood for Christmas. That's gonna be the next holiday after quarantine, though. True. <laughs> Any closing uh, thoughts before we end it, guys? Uh. Don't watch it, but if you've seen it before when you were a kid, I'd recommend watching it again just to see what it's like. No, don't just... ruin your childhood memories. Don't watch it. Yeah, <laughs> don't ruin it. Just live with the yeah. fake memories. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Because once you watch it, you'll be questioning your childhood. You'll be like, did I really have a good childhood? Or 
was a lie. I que- I questioned that. The same thing happened to me when I watched a Lego Star Wars or played Lego Star Wars again. You're like, after, did like, I really have a oh, good yeah. childhood? So, yeah. Did, did I, I really enjoy this? I think the people with bad childhoods was my childhood even worse than I thought it was. <laughs> <laughs> was it really that bad? <laughs> you know. You, <laughs> you know. Like I was abused, but really I could it could have been a lot worse. You know what? Uh, you know what movie I did watch like not too long ago that I watched as a kid that was really good. What? Monster House. If anyone's seen that. Monster oh, House the review? oh, is it? Oh, it's, yeah, oh, is that the, with the they, old man. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that shit's so good still. <laughs> like, oh, that's good to hear because like, I that, really loved that movie as a kid. The animation su- sucks, right? Well, I think the it's whole, animation. Yeah, yeah. The like the whole animation, and everything is like outdated. But yeah. the story, the characters, and everything is still pretty good. I enjoy it. Guys, watch that instead of this movie. Yeah, that like watch. Movie. Yeah, watch that. So yeah, it's until good. next time, guys. Stay safe. Stay inside. And if you live in Florida, we're mad. <sighs> God. Wait, what they do in Florida? Like I've heard some stuff. They open but the beaches I've... back up and a bunch of people. Oh yeah. Ah. Yeah. Oh. So guys, expect a bunch of quarantine videos because we're going to be here. For a while. long Peace time. Out. It's because time. of Florida. Hashtag forget you, Florida. I right, love y'all. Yeah, See y'all later. Florida.